Good morning everyone, Prepper Nurse One here. Today is Saturday, it is the 4th of May, 2024. Didn't get a chance to cut this, obviously, at this part around here, so that's going to be, well, it's not going to happen today because we have rain in the forecast all day today. But um, I'm going to show you, and we're going to actually look together and see where we're at at the moment over here. And I'll show you what I rigged up for right now to get this to work. I didn't want to, I knew I was like, you know, running out of time as far as being able to get this going and get this squared away. So this is what I rigged up for now. Uh, put a, an elbow there, then a smaller piece out, and then I got one of these flexible ones. And I, I screwed everything in so that it's not going to go anywhere and I don't even know myself where we're at with this I don't know if you guys can see how much water is in there or not but uh, yeah, these buckets here actually got some as well to be honest with you but let me just I, get a, I would say and it hasn't rained um, through the night very much. I think it were about like to here, right to this level, um, with the tank for right now. And like I said, it's I'm I'm sure I'm not getting all the water, but uh, this has worked uh, fairly decently. I came out and uh, had to adjust this so that it would flow in better when it was really coming down i mean it was for a while we had a good old rainstorm for a while now right now it's starting to sprinkle again uh like i said the forecast for today is pretty much it's going to be raining all day long and so but uh so you know hey whatever you know like i said it's we're going to get that rain i'm going to try to capture as much water as i can and a, a good steady rain would be awesome but we'll have to we'll have to see what uh, we end up getting here but uh, no I've been pretty excited about I've been waiting <laughs> been like okay you know and that's why I you know the forecast hadn't hadn't been there as far as uh, the forecast hadn't been there as far as uh, you know being able to get that to get that to go so I had just waited and then of course you know a little bit of a procrastinator saw the forecast for yesterday I'm like okay you know I gotta get out I gotta get those parts that I need so that I can uh, you know get this going and get this squared away so I want to give these guys fresh water this morning here all right so I'm seeing means the black hen is probably inside I'm not seeing the black hen so let me uh, I'm gonna go give these guys their water Some of the brown hens in there. The black hen is
All right. So I got to give these guys more food. Um, I'm going to show you also where we're at now. Uh, we didn't get very much sun. We got a little bit of sun early in the day for yesterday, but not a lot. And uh, so we're just uh, solar is down at the moment. Uh, I'm going to show you. I definitely am going to be running the generator for a little bit today. Uh, probably I'll run it for like two hours, uh, something like that. Yep. Right, rain's going to start coming down more. So the way I do this, I give them a scoop of feed. Scoop of feed, scoop of cracked corn. So with these guys, I don't have to do this every single day uh, with their feed. It's maybe once every three days because I just um, like I'll, I'll do a mix in this bucket and then I just watch the bucket. When the bucket's knocked over, <laughs> it's time to give them a new uh, a new dose. I just picked up a new bag. As you can see, those two that I was working out of were very low. Uh, I had picked up a new bag of each uh, just the other day. So, so far, two are ready. It's only nine o'clock in the morning. Maybe we'll go over here and I can show you how this is gonna work. Uh, give me a moment. If we get enough of the rain, I'll actually we'll get a, a, a demonstration. But, uh, so it's going to be one of those kind of days here at the homestead, which is okay. I'm not, you know, it's all right with me. I'm not a big, you know, not not a big deal one way or the other. But uh, remember, folks, we truly are all in this together. We are one race called the human race. As soon as we figure that one out, we're going to be in much, much better shape. Also remember to hug and kiss the ones that you love. Tell them every single day. Tomorrow is not guaranteed. We never know what's going to happen in life. So it's important that we tell the people that we care about every day how we feel. Last but not least, STD. Step thing and day. 
one step at a time, one thing at a time, and one day at a time. Whatever you're trying to accomplish, whatever you're trying to do, you can do it. The only one that's going to stop you from achieving your goals is going to be you. That's it. Nobody else. Stay positive, stay away from the negativity, and you're going to be just fine. I hope everybody has a wonderful day. Uh, please be safe, keep prepping, keep taking care of the things that you can control, and you're going to be all right. Stay away from the negativity and negative people that tell you what you cannot accomplish. Uh, they don't make any difference. They don't matter. The people that matter are the ones that are lifting you up, not trying to drag you down. I hope you all have a... So anyway, I'm, it's not really showing anything yet. Too light of a rain so far. But uh, you get the concept. <laughs> Watch, I'll stop the video and I'll, it'll start flowing out of, in, out of there. But... Uh, so far, so good. I know we've gotten quite a bit there um, from looking at that. If I had to guess, I think we maybe have collected 40 gallons, maybe 50 gallons. I don't know for sure. Uh, but we'll just keep, you know, I'm curious to see where it's going to be by the end of the day. Especially if we get, like this afternoon, it's supposed to be uh, more of a steady rain. So, oh, come on. All right, rain is coming a little bit harder now. I'm trying to give this a minute, guys, so you can see this. Uh, I still have to pick up, for the cap there, a wire meshing, uh, like a screening, like I have on my other tote. And uh, I will get that. That'll help keep all the twigs and bugs and everything else from, you know, being in there. So. It will start flowing, I promise you. <laughs> it's just a matter of when here. Oh, come on. We're going to give this one more minute, guys, so I, I want to see if, you know, if you'll be able to see this. Okay. Well, just a little bit coming out of there. There we go. See, it's hitting right into the center there. When the flow is stronger, it really will kick in there, but that's what it does. So, there you go. <laughs> I'm like, come on, this has got to get going. So, I mean, we're probably still losing water, you know, but uh, as long as some is going in there for now, and we'll adjust things, you know, more so, so that things are, you know, better. But that's what we got, and it'll work, and we'll have more fresh water to work with, so that'll be a good thing. Now, what do we use the water for real quick, right? Uh, we'll use it for washing dishes, we'll use it for washing up, uh, you know, I'll filter what I need to filter, and I'll use it for drinking water. Uh, any water that I'm going to use to drink or cook with is going to get filtered first. Oh, that's always the case. So, all right, guys, I'm jumping off. I'll see you later. Prepper Nurse One out for now.